dinner party. You're throwing a dinner party, only five people. Who are the five, Stacey? Wow. Can you, they have to be living? No, I mean, it's a dinner party. You can invite anybody. Five people. Five people. Wow. David McCullough. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I would certainly want, certainly want Ben Franklin on there, if only because there's so many things I couldn't figure out. Like, who was the mother of your child, for God's sake? You know, I mean, that's just not fair that you address a book to a child and don't tell us who the mother was. <laughs> um, gosh, that's a really hard one. Um, most of them would be writers. Most of the rest would be writers, probably. Mm -hmm. um, go ahead. And if, if names come up, just throw out, throw okay. out some names. Wow. Who would you who would you invite? Stacy Schiff. <laughs> okay, so you got four you've got four I'll be over slots tomorrow. left. <laughs> four more to go. Mm -hmm. Cole Porter. Oh, mm -hmm. that's a great idea. Cole Porter. Um, I would invite Leontine Price. Uh, oh, that's great. <sighs> I didn't really mean to stump. You. I know this is. I, a I, I, see, I think both of us have lists at home. Am I right about uh, biographical? Subjects? John Singer Sargent. Mm. I'd have him. John Singer, Sergeant. And how many can we have? Okay, you've got, you've got uh, two more. Because you said uh, stage. Oliver Wendell Holmes, Sr. Ah. And he's the one that said talking is a very good way to find out what you think. <laughs> Stacey? And I want John Kenneth Galbraith, who I think was the wittiest man of the 20th century. John Kenneth Galbraith. Yeah, yeah. Yes, I, think we've got a, I, I think we've got a great dinner that, party. And when do we have this dinner? Um... How about right now? Cause